The global burden of cancer is enormous and growing. It's really fueled by population expansion in developing countries as well as growth of the aging around the world. Philips really takes a unique approach to developing oncology solutions. We focus on what we call the care cycle. We follow the patient in their footprints going from early detection into diagnosis, into therapy, following them through survivorship and even palliative care. Right now, care is very disconnected. One of the major problems we have in any pathology laboratory is the fact that we have to distribute, keep track of, uh, and, and just deal with uh, multiple thousands sometimes of slides every day. Finding where they go, where they need to go to, who has them, who wants them, all of those issues are a major problem, even in a small, relatively small uh, footprint like we have at Mass General. It takes a, a lot of time, a lot of resources, and has numerous potential problems uh, on a daily basis. Pathology is one of the few analytic professions that has not adopted full-scale digitization. Samples have been processed in more or less the same way for over 100 years. For example, a tissue sample is processed, sectioned, then stained. Much of these processes are labor-intensive. The lab must then assemble and distribute the slides to the right pathologist, a task which is very manual and very time-consuming. If we can digitize all of our slides easily, rapidly, at high fidelity. Then we can apply computational power and network connectivity to the study of tissue and, uh, more importantly, the practice of pathology. Network connectivity and computer power, computers, are the driving forces of innovation, quality, and productivity, you know, in the modern world. And pathology has kind of been held back because uh, the fact we can't digitize a very large part of our practice, which has been the glass slide. By digitizing the images, the pathologists normally view through a microscope, our goal is to offer solutions that help to improve the operational efficiency of the lab and to help doctors make faster and more accurate decisions. The three main benefits of digital pathology are what you'd expect from any, any time when you digitize the process. But there'll be increased communication uh, of, of pathology data, slides, across distances and across time. There'll be ability to organize our cases much in a much more cleaner, more efficient way, right? as opposed to having a physical component of our, sli our slides and our paper and then our computer systems, a single data set. And the third thing, are the tools that will be created to allow us to interact with that digital data set, either for diagnosis uh, or for just productivity uh, in the future. A digital workflow involves more than delivering high quality images at high speeds. It's about making a seamless fit into the laboratory processes and the information systems. For an efficient digital workflow, there are three essential requirements. The very first is quality. The second most important factor is system performance, especially for high-throughput labs. The third is integration. The greatest workflow efficiencies will be obtained when digital pathology solutions are embedded in the daily workflow. Philips will play an important role in clinical decision support based on an IT backbone, and using that information, they will be able to make more informed decisions. This is really laying the groundwork for what we call personalized medicine. I think we can look at evolution of digital radiology as an example of the kinds of benefits imaging can bring to pathology. Digital imaging will enable new ways to improve efficiency and quality. It could enable pathology departments to expand access to their expertise both regionally and globally. Ultimately, digital pathology will allow for faster and more precise diagnosis of tissue samples anytime and anywhere. The promise of digital pathology is real and I think it will really revolutionize healthcare. We're doing things that we've never done before. We're creating solutions that we, we've not had before. We're doing things organically and even finding partners to complement what we do to really improve that health and well-being. For us, it's personal here at Philips as well.